this thing that makes you think fasting and prayer is for pastors spending time with God days and weeks is for those who want to stand by the altar that thing is the reason why you will never break through because even after the breakthrough you must maintain it with an active life of fasting and prayer yes or no are you kidding me there's nothing you take that cannot be stolen back from you there's nothing God gives you that can't be stolen from you if you do not man your territory it's not enough to fight and win you must be capable of manning your territory from invaders ah please don't think that God's servants are normal people moving about they are surrounded I'm telling you it's good to pray for them but please don't be afraid all those dreams you're having are useless dreams of I saw you having accidents useless dreams accident call that's how accidents used to happen you just kill a man that is being guarded go and find Bwari and shoot him since you don't like him if it's like that uh, anybody who does not like you can kill you go and find Trump today you're not happy fly and go and shoot him you will find out that without him knowing you were coming you will die yes or no because there is a system around him that ensures that intruders don't make it to him that's why we can stand and do what we are doing and not be afraid you can see you can grow in one year the growth somebody has not grown in 10 years but in Nigeria we are always counting the years I'm 10 years now in God you are still on diapers you are saying you are 10 years now in God you are still with feeding bottle you are saying it's my 15th year now as a Christian that's not how we calculate it in the kingdom is somebody hearing what I'm saying there are many many examples we don't have time one of the teenagers in church had an experience like that she sat down on the bike here in Bodija from Bodija market to this place is how many minutes 20 minutes after she was still on bike she was in Ologwenru where is God with these ministries sir Sorry. where is God with these ministries Bodija so she came back after her eyes cleared and said ah, where am I where are you taking me to and the bike man said you can see he said I can see where are you taking me to so he stopped calm down go away so the jar spoiled that's the meaning of that right she came here and she was telling me the story in Liberty Kai, I was so angry. I said, I am not ashamed of yourself. You sat down on a bike and the jazz walked on you after all these years of being with us. You sat down and it walked on you. Don't ever call yourself a teenager in this church again. You sat down on a bike. And the jazz walked on you. You expect me to clap for you. I'm ashamed that I know you. That I have taught you for months. And you sat on a bike. And the jazz walked on you. She was crying that day. Because that's how to respond. She went back to. That's what I'm sharing. She went back to Bodija. And said I will do my own back. But father is not a bastard. Say after me, my father. <laughs> Went back. She was looking for this bike man. She didn't see him. He said, There's one man. He's house like this. He looked like this. He's short. He's dark. Looks for him all over the place. You don't see this guy. Ah! She was sad. She wants to come and tell me story, but she can't find the man. So she said, anyone I enter, I will see show the person. She looked at someone. She said, I look I looked for someone that looks like a kidnapper. I said, how do you know kidnappers? <laughs> she said, this man was looking, you know, was looking young and haggard, looked like that other person. So I said, you, take me to go do it. Enter the bike. If a maker is here, you can bear witness to what happened. Enter the bike 
and consciously was releasing the atmosphere of God's power on this man. They got here. The bike man stopped the bike and put his head on the, the handle to rest because he was feeling electric shock. So a maker came out and said, Oga, are you waiting for a customer? What are you doing here? He said, I don't know waiting that girl do me. Oh. No. If it, was, if it was a joke, can you celebrate Jesus? <laughs> Satan is in trouble. Satan wants us to be foolish. He wants us to be slow. Go. Stupid. That's giving you all things that pertain to life and godliness. A witch should be thinking twice before flying over your house. They should be arguing over it in the coven. It's risky. No, this one is not. This one, no. This, no, we can't try this one. This is out of it. This one, uh, this one is Mumu. We can cry over this one. Bring two pints of blood from this house when you're coming. This one, bring pints of blood from the whole house. So are you sure everybody's foolish there? This one, the whole street, bring blood. <laughs> This street, can we pass? no pass by all There's one Christian there. Her own force feed has covered the whole street. We will like to, we will like to oppress the people in the streets because they are under our kingdom. The problem is she's living around them. All this is inside the believer's life, but you determine how much you express. Is somebody hear what I'm saying? Declare to me, I see.